Hey everyone, Justice Good here, and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create an icy cool photo effect. So as you can see, this is after, before, after. So let's go ahead and start with your original photo. This effect can be added to any photo, it'll just make it look like a more cold, icy look to the photo. So all you're going to do to begin is go to Layer, New Adjustment Layer, and select color balance. Once you select OK, the color balance adjustment menu should pop up and we'll start with the shadows. So go ahead and turn the blue up to about 30. And of course everything that we're doing here you can adjust it by plus or minus like 2 or 3 and it'll be different for your photo. Uh, so different settings will look different for each photo but I'm going to use about plus 30, it ended up being 33 and then mid-tones where we'll go to cyan turn it down to about negative 20 and turn the blue up to about positive 30 next go to highlights turn the red up to about positive 20 and the yellow down to about negative 39 and then make sure preserve luminosity is checked on. Alright, so next we can go to layer, new fill layer, and select solid color. Here your color picker will come up where you want to pick a bright cyan. So if you want to use the same exact color I'm using, it is going to be color code 00F6FF and you can just type that in there and you'll get the same exact color I'm using. And then set that to multiply blending mode and then turn the opacity of that layer to about 20 percent. Alright and then go to layer, new adjustment layer, black and white, select OK, select your black and white layer and set the blending mode of it to soft light. So now it's already getting that darker, more cold look. Um, as a final step, we'll just make it look a bit more icy. So go to Layer, New Adjustment Layer, Photo Filter. All right, and then select under Filter. There should be a cooling filter. In parentheses, it'll say 82. Should be a preset. Go ahead and select that one and turn the density up to about 50%. Make sure preserved luminosity is checked on, and then select that layer and turn the opacity of it down to about 50%. So as you can see, um, in final, this is after, and this is before. So it gives your photo a much more icy look. And of course, you can always add some brightness and contrast to your liking. Um, and tweak every percentage a little bit to your specific photo, but this works great on a variety of different photos. So I hope you enjoyed this effect. If you did, please make sure to like this video, um, subscribe to my channel for more tutorials, and check out all my other tutorials. Feel free to leave a comment below if you have a question. Alright, so just as good. Until next time.